Hey guys, Sean again, Custom Offsets, Custom Offsets TV on the YouTube. Got vehicle spotlight for you today. Just finished up this 2017. It's gonna have another of the six inch BDS lips with the Fox upgraded shocks. This time's we're going now, 18 by nines and 35s. Let's go. Okay guys, like I said, this one's gonna have that six inch BDS lift kit. So you'll see it's got the uh, lift strut in there. And then on the back, you'll see it's got the 2.0 Fox shocks. So you did the Fox upgrade on it. Which has been super, super popular this summer. And then for fitment, he went with an 18 by nine. So it's an 18, nine wide, negative 12 fuel octane. And since uh, you guys spoke up, brought back my hundo Mario. I'm back, baby. And I would, this is a weird one to do a lip test because you could kind of do it like this and say, you know, it's about two, two and a half inches. Or you could kind of lay it here and say between the spoke up to this ridge that they put in there and call it a three inch. But pretty much anyone that's going with a nine wide isn't really looking for a lip wheel. They're looking for more of, you know, the design and the style of that wheel. And then that's gonna be wrapped in a 35, 12 and a half. It's Toyo Open Country AT2 and uh, 35 high, 12 and a half wide. So what you'll see is because you got that 12 and a half wide and you're on a nine inch wide wheel, you're gonna have plenty of sidewall. This is gonna be your more, I'm willing to take this off road because the wheel's gonna be protected by the tire. And that's why a lot of guys will do that. You're also gonna see it's got a lot more sidewall because you're on an 18 inch wheel on a 35 inch tire. So you've got this big old sidewall, which is gonna actually make for a much better ride. And whenever guys are looking at, you know, tire selection sizes or wheel sizes, that's what you're kind of thinking about. If you want the ride comfort, the more air you put between here, as far as the sidewall, the better ride that you're gonna get because you're literally, literally riding on that cushion of air. And what you'll see with this one is that 9 wide negative 12 up front, because this is a lift kit that's gonna push that out a little bit, it should have a, yeah, it's a knuckle lift, so it's got the replacement knuckle. It's pushing that front wheel out even more than factory. So on the rear, you'll see it's in a little bit. So if I were to chase this line down, you know, I'm a lug and a half out back here you're just inside the tread. So what some guys will do is they'll put that 1.75 inch bore spacer back here on both sides, obviously, and they'll push that out so that you run your track width more square. Other guys couldn't care less and they just leave it as is and run it because a factory truck's gonna have that front stance a little bit also. But you'll see this is a 2017. This thing's pretty much brand new Chevy Silverado Z71. You'll see that hood that I've always bragged about. You see it's got all the color matching going on, a little bit of chrome trim, and of course the accent lighting should have projectors. Yeah, projector headlights. He hasn't done tint yet. I'm sure that's gonna be in the list of must-dos. He did a cover already, so it's the backflip cover on here, and literally it just flips up in uh, four equal sections, or semi somewhat equal sections, and then you can uh, access the bed. And then he did the amp steps, which are becoming super popular because once you get that six inch lift, that's a hike to go up in there. So with those amp steps, you flip her down and just roll and you can hop right up in there and you're good to go. You'll see interior on this one. It's got, you know, most of the options. 
It's got the cloth interior, but a whole bunch of goodies as far as options and sweetness. And this one is the double cab is what Chevy calls it. So you'll see that the front door is full size door and then the rear door is a three quarter door, a little bit smaller. So this is where they used to have the third doors. And now this is just, you know, the smaller rear door. Plenty of room for the kids and definitely can fit the adults if need be. This is what I've got for CO24 and I think it's plenty of room. So like I said, it's 2017. Chevy Silverado 1500 Z71. It's gonna have the six inch BDS with the Fox upgrades, the 18 by nine negative 12 fuel octanes, and then some 35, 12 and a half Toyo Open Country AT2 Extreme. Peace. Hi, four.